two, part two of the Celica build. Um, sorry about the hiatus. Um, we did get the bruiser rocking and rolling. Next stage is digging into the Celica and we will be pulling the engine and then splitting the engine and then tearing apart the engine to see if we can make this thing healthy and happy and running again. Um, that's the game plan. So in your oil pan, you're supposed to have oil. Not, Not river gum? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. We've got the head torn off the block at this point, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna end up using a straight edge and feeler gauges, and we kinda line up the straight edge, and we do it on corner to corner, then straight ahead, and then the other corner to corner, and, and we're using those feeler gauges to see if we can slide underneath, where if they do slide underneath at any point, we know for a fact that it's warped. Uh, we start with the head, we go through, and obviously we're sliding through with the smaller gauges. We get all the way up to 15 thousandths, and, uh, and that's kind of where our limit is. So we know, unfortunately, that the head is warped. We uh, carry on with measuring the block and you'll, uh, you'll see that in just a second. It looks a whole lot better than the head does.
So anyway, we got the, uh, the motor torn out, torn down. It's not good as we expected. We measured and the head is definitely warped. Um, we checked prices and to get the head remachined is gonna be about 400 bucks. Now normally this isn't a big deal, except for with this engine, it's common enough and simple enough. We should be able to find a whole engine for not much more, especially with the head looking like it's already been machined at least once. We don't know if that's salvageable, so right now we're looking into options. We're kind of in another holding pattern on this, unfortunately, but we're gonna see, maybe we'll get a different engine, maybe we'll get creative, maybe we'll update the engine a little bit. We might just end up machining that head and getting it back together. We think the block is probably salvageable. You know, once again, with our luck, we'll, we'll dig in and we'll see. All right, yeah, so follow along. Um, this is obviously gonna be a, a build over a span, so definitely stay tuned. Um, subscribe if you want, follow along on Instagram. If you like face box, I think we even have one of those. Um, but yeah, stay tuned, this will be a fun build. Yeah, there you go. Deep squats. <laughs> you got that? Got it. <laughs>